Hi, Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, and I'm joined with Don Dalman. How are you doing, Don? Hi, Nicole. I'm good. How are you? I'm pretty good because we're just going to show you everything that we just learned about the new Hyundai Ioniq 5. Yes, the new car from Hyundai, and the most interesting thing about it, it was just built as an e-car. It was not a compromise using an old chassis and then putting an e-motor in it. It was just built with a new platform, so it's a perfectly new generation e-car. And it has really cool technology in it, like a solar roof and an 800 volt battery. Yeah, and a lot of more that you can learn here in our video. Hyundai has launched the Ionic 5, a great looking mid-size crossover, and it opens a new chapter for the Korean car maker. It's packed with a lot of cool tech, an 800 volt battery, the interior has recycled plastic bottles inside, but my absolute favorite has to be the sunroof. We got to speak with Raf van Nuffel from Hyundai to learn more about this really cool feature. It's really seamlessly integrated into the, the roof, uh, so it, it, it looks almost like a, a sunroof, so it has the, the black uh, tone, uh, but if you look closer, you see the, the, so, the solar cells inside. Uh, of course, the efficiency greatly depends on, on where you want to use it and how, but we have uh, calculated that in the south of Europe, let's say south of Spain, with uh, normal conditions, on an annual base you, you would have uh, an equivalent of, of uh, 2,000 extra kilometers. Because we actually do, uh, do charge the battery with this, with this solar energy, uh, so it makes the whole driving more efficient, so it can support uh, things like climate control or heating, uh, but it also can charge the battery and therefore extend the range. One of the most important parts of a new electric car is of course the battery, the battery pack and the whole battery system. Hyundai has decided to use an 800 volt battery system for their new Ionic 5. But what does that mean? Well, in short, it means that you can charge your car in a very short period of time. Providing that you have a supercharger, you can get up to 100 km in just 5 minutes of charging. Rafa Nuffel explains how the system works. As, as customers want more driving range, battery packs get bigger and bigger. But that also has the downside that the charging times get longer and longer. And, and that's actually the key advantage where uh, 800 volt uh, plays in. Uh, the charging times are greatly uh, uh, reduced. So just to give you an idea for the Ionic 5, uh, you can charge from a 10 to 80% state of charge in just 18 minutes. So that means if you just have five minutes time, for instance, you can get already 100 kilometer of extra range. So we learn a lot about solar and 800 volt battery technology. But the new Hyundai Ionic 5 has also something really new. It's called V2L technology. What does that mean? This technology means that you can, for example, take your laptop into your car and plug it into a normal socket. It's not that you have to USB or something like that, just a normal socket like at home. And then the laptop gets its power from the battery. You can also charge cars on the road if you want to, or even your own home. V2L indeed stands for vehicle to load. So you have this uh, quite powerful battery pack and of course it helps you to drive from A to B but it can do so much more actually and there V2L is actually a, a very nice application because we have actually two, uh, two ways. You have an interior uh, V2L which is uh, located underneath uh, or at the bottom of the rear seat. So this is where you use it inside the car so you can charge any uh, electric appliance that is usually yeah, uh, using 220 volts. So whether it's a laptop or, or uh, an e-scooter or something, you can plug in and charge basically. And then we also have an exter external uh, V2L solution. This is actually using the normal charging plug, but you need a certain adapter, a specific converter that makes then the reverses, let's say the, the power uh, uh, to, to give power instead of uh, charging. So you actually discharge the battery of the vehicle and you can charge again uh, an electric bicycle uh, or, or, or something uh, again using 220 volts. That were our first impressions of the new Hyundai Ionic 5. How do you like it so far? I really do like it and there's one huge thing that we haven't really touched upon which is the interior and how much 
reusable and sustainable technology appears inside. Yeah, but we're going to test drive the car and we will give you more information about this in the future.